Hi, I'm Luke Austin from Ledger Limited. Today we're talking about smoke testing asbestos enclosures. It's a requirement under the New Zealand Asbestos Regulations that when you're undertaking friable works, you need to test these for leaks. The main method of doing that is using a smoke machine, having a remover this inside the enclosure and the assessor outside the enclosure checking for leaks. For demonstration purposes, I'm using our garage. As you can see, the ute will not fit into the garage has been co-opted by my daughter for a weight training. Now we'll just close this garage door and get this test under the way. Oh, here goes the smoke machine. Just for reference purposes, that um, cross trainer is about a meter away from the camera inside most enclosures we've got obstacles that the removalist has to navigate around as you can as you can see visibility is slowly and surely decreasing now when you're working out when to do your um, smoke test, do you take into account how the removalist will see the obstacles and be able to navigate around them? Or if worst case comes and you need to access the removalist, how are you actually going to get to them? As you can see I haven't actually gone very long and that um, cross trainer is um, getting pretty short on visibility. I've sp stopped the smoke machine but I think you'll see that the demonstration shows that um, visibility gets less and less. Now that wasn't much smoke in a very small enclosure but, but even so I'll just in a minute I'll just put some more smoke in but that's that small amount What's it done to the visibility? Could you find someone in that?